Praise the Lord. Welcome, Victory family and friends, to our word of encouragement for today. I want to remind all of you of our time of intercession tonight at 7 o'clock. We'll be live streaming into your home. Please join us. So many things we need to be praying about in our nation, in the body of Christ, in the church. So I look forward to your joining us tonight. God hears and he answers prayer. I'd like to turn your attention to John chapter 16. One verse we'll read, verse 7 from the Amplified Bible. John 16, verse 7. This is something that has been stirring in my spirit uh, today, uh, yesterday, and it reads this way in the Amplified Bible. John 16, 7. However, I am telling you nothing but the truth. Of course, this is Jesus talking. I'm telling you nothing but the truth when I say it is profitable. Say profitable. Profitable. It is good, expedient, advantageous for you that I go away. Because if I do not go away, the comforter, counselor, helper, advocate, intercessor, strengthener, standby, will not come to you. And then he says this in the Amplified, enter close fellowship with you. But if I go away, I will send him to you to be in close fellowship with you. Question, is the Holy Spirit in close fellowship with you? That's what I begin to think about. It is, you know, Holy Spirit, am, am I ignoring you? Am I flowing with you? Am I grieving you? Am I quenching you? Am I making you happy? I mean, so many people want to be around all these great personalities. There's no one greater than God and God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. They are one and the Holy Spirit has been sent to live on the inside of us to be in close fellowship with, on, with us. The greatest of all living on the inside of you, of us, God by his spirit in us. And he's come to be in close fellowship with us. Notice, Amplify says he's a counselor. Are you allowing him, am I allowing him, are we allowing him to be our counselor, our helper, our advocate, our intercessor, our strengthener, our standby? Oh, 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 please. I want to admonish, encourage you to please acknowledge the person and ministry of the Holy Spirit. Acknowledge his presence on the inside of your spirit and, and, and flow with him and, 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 and acknowledge what he's come to do. Call him your helper, call him your intercessor, call him your standby, call him your strengthener, call him your counselor, call him these things. Allow him to manifest those things in our lives. Allow him to be in close fellowship with us. Father, in the name of Jesus, forgive us where we have ignored the Spirit of God. Forgive us where we have quenched and grieved the Holy Spirit. And now, Father, from this moment on, Lord, help us Help us to, to understand his workings. Help us to be in close fellowship with him. Father, we believe for that now, and we thank you for all that he's come to do. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. I believe that you and I, we will get to know him better, the communion of the Holy Spirit, and we will allow him to change every area of our lives and to make us more like Jesus. God bless you. Let me hear from you. Don't forget intercessory prayer tonight at 7 o'clock.